Hey guys, welcome back. I am so tired. Um, not feeling the best today, but I did. I want to get this part done, at least get this unboxing part done, and I'll do the try-on probably another day. So hopefully this goes up soon. But I have my trend scent that came in, and I want to see if there's anything fun in here. Um, I asked for cheaper prices because the last box was a little pricey. I asked for no jeans because I have too many, and um, I just i am not wearing jeans in 100-degree weather here in Virginia with the humidity. Um, and I asked for maxis if they have them in petites. I, I can't wear like a regular maxi because it would just, I'd, I'd be stepping all over it. So I definitely need a petite. I also um, have a stitch fix coming and I asked, I think, for one more maxi from them in a petite. They, I know, do have petites. So I kind of just doubled up because I wasn't sure. So, well, my bundles are oh, a little bit messy, but let's... This is what it looks like inside the box. Trendsend is a nice subscription box if you don't want to pay a styling fee. They do, um, you get three complete outfits and they send you um, style how to style them, which is nice. And um, they only charge your card a dollar just to make sure it works. And then that dollar is credited back. So it's really you no know, styling fee. Um, and you can get these, this is, you can have them reoccurring. So the minute that you return one, you get the next one back. Um, I think I have them set. I don't have them set monthly. I have them set for when I want to buy. So that way I can work it around my finances and fit it into, into my schedule. Um, so it says, hi, Terry. Happy Trenson Day. I had so much uh, fun styling you today. I gave you looks that will keep you cool and comfortable in the warm weather. Many of the items are on sale as well. If you need anything in a different size, leave the size, blah, blah, blah. Ship it to you. Thank you for your feedback. It helps us style you better each time. Now, I got Megan. Um, I haven't, I, I don't know, maybe the little girl I had, Amanda's not with them anymore. Um, but let's go through outfit one. This might not be outfit one, but it's on the, it's the one on top. So we're going to open it and I'll find out. Okay. Yes, this is outfit one. So outfit one consists of a dress, a denim jacket, and then another dress. Two dresses and a jacket, it looks like. Okay, so this first dress is the Alice and Joy size medium Carolina cross front dress. It was $78, marked down to $58, marked down to $44. 99 and it's red and like floral let me look at this okay so I thought so okay so someone did use my referral link thank you thank you thank you what that does if somebody uses your referral link they don't give you like like if you you know like with some of the ones if you keep a certain amount of a certain amount of pieces you get a 25% or a 20% discount what they do is if somebody uses your referral link all the prices in your box even sale items are marked down 20% more. So this this dress is actually only going to cost $35.99 if it fits, which is a great price. Um, and so it's definitely beneficial if you do transcend to share your link with those that you know because now that referral credit is good for one time and it's good for anything in that box. If I didn't buy anything in this box, I don't get that 20% again. So it's just like a one-time deal. So, and she said, I thought in the hot weather, dresses would keep you the most comfortable. I give you two different dresses for two different occasions. The Carolina cross front will be perfect for dressier occasions, I guess for like work. And the Monroe V neck dress is nice for every day. Both are on sale. The Kara denim jacket is a wardrobe staple. It's thin enough to keep you covered and cool. So let's take a look at this one. So this will be 35 down from 78. That's 50% off. Oops. Oh, let's see if I can get it right for you to show it to you. So it's got, there we go, a pretty um, cross front top. And then it just cinches up the waist, it looks like a little bit. And it comes down, and it looks like it might be like a high low. It's hard to, it's hard to see, but I think it might be a high low. Um, obviously, just it's a nice lightweight material. This would be good for work if it. Um, and it, it's got really pretty colors in it. It's got some pinks and almost like a plum color in it and gray. Um, so very pretty. So we'll see how this looks. You never know. Um, that would that would be something I could certainly dress up. Then this is the other dress. This is the uh, Monroe V-neck dress. It was 68, marked down to 49. 
And this one would be $39.99. And this is an olive and it's like a cotton dress. So it's just got the little like things here up front, little extra detail. And it looks like it's just a straight up and down kind of knit dress, which is probably gonna be super, super comfortable um, for the summer. Um, so that'd be a great beach dress actually, just to walk on the sand at night. That would be nice, we're, which we're going to be going in August to Nags Head. So that'll be fun. So that we'll try that on. And then the Hush, then the denim jacket in white um, is by cut, cut from the cloth, and it's $71.20. I will try this on for you, but I won't buy this because I bought a denim jacket in white already. And I, I got another denim jacket that I got. I got, a, I got two blue denims. One's destroyed, one's not. And then I got a white denim jacket and I got a pink denim jacket. I think I've said a denim. Um, but cut from the cloth is nice and you can roll the sleeves up it looks like. There we go. And I'll tell you what the price. This one is not on sale. It's $89 but with a 20% off discount it would be $71.20 if I wanted to keep that. So we'll try it on with the dresses so you guys can see it in case you want to get get that for yourself. All right, so that was outfit one. Outfit two. I think I did ask for some shorts as I'm looking in here. I see some shorts. So I think I think I did ask her for some shorts um, if she had some for bottoms. All right, so what does it say about outfit two? There's a tank, a tunic tank, and a Wanderer short by Sanctuary, and it says the Wanderer shorts provide color and comfort. We just got them, and customers love them. The Cody tunic stripe tank will be long, but you can tuck it in or tie the end in a knot. The tank is also on sale. Throw on a cute wedge or cheek sand chic sandal chic. I don't know, and you're ready to go. I actually asked for some uh, wedges or wedge sandals. I think in a neutral color from Stitch Fix. But I also asked for black flats, and they're not going to send me two pairs of shoes. I don't think. I said one or the other, whatever you have. So we'll see if one of those come in. Um, so let's look at this. The nice thing is they do send you sale items. So this is the, um, this is by Alice and Joy. Was 38, marked down to 29, and would be $23.99 if I wanted to keep it. Very cute, just little little tank. I do have a really nice kind of um, gray and white striped tank from Trendsend that I kept that I wore in one of my videos that I filmed. I don't, it, this is different, but I don't know if I need to. This is a long one though. This is like a long tunic. So that'd be cute with a pair of leggings even. So there's that. Um, and that, that's a, that's, it feels really nice. Like it's soft and comfortable and I love soft and comfortable lately. I'm getting to the age guys where like, I don't want to be uncomfortable during the day. Like occasionally when I like, I'll really dress up and I'll, I'll go all out and I'll wear something that maybe isn't the most comfortable, but for the most part, I like to be comfortable. These are cute. Look at these guys. They're short though. So these are sanctuary. These are a size 31, which is a little bigger, but maybe they run small. So um, she gave me a size 31 and one and a size, I was looking at it um, on the sheet in a size eight and the other. So I don't know. Um, these are $69, dang. <laughs> these are not on sale in the color chili, like a little chili pepper, I guess. They're cute though. Uh, I won't pay $69 for them though. Uh, let's see how much they are with the discount. 55.20. That's better, but still expensive. And I think they're going to be a little too short for my comfort. I usually like um, like a four or five inch inseam. I don't think this tells you really what you got, what that is. No. So we'll try them on and we'll see what they look like. I do love the color though. I think the color is stunning, and I don't have anything like that. I have green from Stitch Fix. Okay, and my last outfit here oh, this looks neat some fun stuff in here this is what I'm seeing guys and they do also give you a prepaid mailer too to mail everything back theirs is a priority mailer too yeah I take these to work we have a Dropbox like there with a UPS and 
UPS, FedEx, and the mailman come, and we have boxes and just dump it in there, and they just take it, which is nice. So the first thing, it looks like maybe a white tank. Yeah, this is just a simple white tank right here, and it's not on sale. This is a slub tank, one size fits all, fitted scoop tank, $44. It's Michael by Michael Stars. Um, <laughs> where is this one? Would be $35.20. I doubt I'll get that. I mean, it's you're paying for the Michael Stars brand here. Unless it's, I mean, it's got to do something special to me to make me pay 35 bucks for a very see-through tank. Um, and it's also kind of like a muscle, it reminds me of like a muscle shirt, and I don't really necessarily think that's going to be really flattering on me. But, you know, and I don't know that I need this, so we'll, we'll see. What's this next thing? This is pretty, whatever it is. It's pink and lace. Oh, I see what we're doing here. I see why she sent that now. Okay, this looks like a kimono. Yeah, Kim Kimmy kimono, one size. It was $68, marked down to $59, marked down to $29, marked down to $24. And then with the extra discount, $19.99. So I will get this if I like this. Um, right now I can tell you I like it. If it looks pretty, so it's it's just got your, you know, your kimono sides there. Um, and along the edges, I don't know if you guys can see this, but it's got a beautiful um, little lace detail. And that detail looks like, yeah, that detail goes all the way to the bottom. And it's almost to me like almost a pink, um, I don't know, like a pink tie-dye or something. It's really pretty. So for $19.99, that's probably mine. I could do a lot with that. Granted, it's all got to be solid tops underneath, and I do have another white um, tank type of a shirt that I got, which is a little bit longer, that I got from Transcend that might work, that might be almost exactly the same thing. Then a pair of cut from the cloth um, Catherine Boyfriend shorts. So these are cute, and these do have the right length in them. So we'll see if they fit. I don't know that an eight's gonna fit me. An eight has been, even though I know the Catherine, the, the cut from the cloth, they usually size you down a size because after you wear them a while, they stretch, they stretch out. I don't think I'm quite in an eight yet. I really truly am a ten. So um, I will be able to button these, I'm sure, because I have two other pairs of eight uh, jeans that are are eights, and I can button them and I can wear them. They're just not as comfortable. And like I said, I'm at that age where like. I don't want to really sacrifice the comfort part. If it's more comfortable for me to go up a size, I would just rather go up a size. But let's see how much these guys are. So these guys are $69 as well. And so they would be $55.20. So they got to be stunners. I do need, I really do need some, um, shorts that have a, a good long decent inseam because I have chubby thighs and it's so uncomfortable guys for me and I know some of you girls probably understand my pain here but um you get chub rub you know you you have like when I wear a dress it even happens and I went to Antigua I had the worst time I broke out in such a rash from it you know from shaving in the sand and and my thighs rubbing together and um, it was so uncomfortable and horrible and so under a dress like I can wear the little boy shorts or, you know like the little spank shorts and that's fine but with short shorts I can't do that so um, I need shorts that are gonna be longer I don't think I think I was when I was 20 and I was 97 pounds was the last time my thighs didn't touch they're probably gonna touch now at 43 for the rest of my life so um, but these will be great if they work and I will invest in those if they, if they make sense. So, um, what does she say about that outfit? These Catherine boyfriend shorts are denim in distress, but are not denim pants. They're the last ones we have in store. So if I like them, I better get them. The Kimmy tie dye kimono is easy breezy, fashion forward and on sale. The fitted scoop tank is everyone's favorite layering piece. Throw on a wedge and a simple necklace and you'll be... And, and you will look ready to go, Megan. So she did a good job styling me. Um, definitely took my feedback to heart. She gave me a lot of items on sale, good prices in this trunk, or trunk in this um, Transcend. So I will try everything on and I will come back, but I think I'm gonna take a nap first. So I'll see you guys in a minute. Hey 
guys, it's actually a couple of days later. I'm a little going to be a little quiet because everyone's sleeping upstairs. Happy Father's Day, by the way, to all of the fathers out there. Um, it's early. It's like six something in the morning, I think, when I'm doing this. So I don't have any makeup on or anything. Um, I did get my hair done. I wanted to show you guys the different color. Uh, we were finally able to pull the blonde all the way through. And this color... Uh, the brown is my natural color hair, but we um, she he just put some in it a little bit more So it had a little bit more contrast to darken that up a little bit. So uh, let me know what you think about that um, All right, so this is actually outfit number three This is a I'm going to show you the Michael stars fitted scoop tank, which fits really nice, but I think it was too expensive Let's See if I can tell you um Okay, the tank is 30, oh, well, okay, so it's 35.20. It, I, I don't know why I was thinking it was more. Um, the shorts are, uh, the they're cut from the cloth, and they're 71.20, so they're kind of, ex oh, no, 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 is that, that is not what I'm looking for. These are 55.20, so that's not too bad either. And the kimono I'm going to show you is 19.99, which I'm going to get, because it's 19.99, and it's cute, so hold on. Okay, so the Michael Stars tank. Oops. Yeah, sorry, I got a necklace on, I guess, from last night. And I didn't take it off. Well, it's all twisted, but okay. Anyway, so here we go. Here is the tank top. And it is fitted, um, which is fine if you're not bloated. Um, these shorts, however, they fit great. So I probably didn't keep these. Um, they came rolled up once, so they have one roll, but you can probably unroll them. And underneath that, there's some, like, distressing. Um, and I could probably roll them up a second time if I wanted. So let me pull this up and show you guys. They're nice, and they come down low, but they're not, like, Bermuda low. Um... I'm not like a big fan of the Bermuda shorts, um, primarily because I'm super, super short. So I feel like they would just look funny on me. I've seen other girls wear them and they look fine in them, but, um, I just look more stumpy. <laughs> All right. So let's find this kimono. This kimono I, I wore the other day actually. And so it's a little wrinkle. I need to wash it, but I'm going to keep this cause it's comfortable and it's hello hair and it's really beautiful. Um, and it's, it's got like, you can see on the sides like that. Let me back up. So here it is. I would not wear it with this because I feel like it looks funny. This is how she paired it. But I do feel like it looks kind of funny with the, um, being longer than the shorts. Um, I can tell you the way that I wore it the other day is I have a white pocket tee that I wore with it. And then I had a, um, and this, and then I had leggings on because my tee was really, really long. And then I had like a strappy high heel, well, not high heel, a strappy like wedge. Just for, since this um, is fitted, I'm going to go ahead and tuck this in. Um, for reference, the sizes, I know the cut from the cloth, are, these are an eight. Um, the kimono is one size and the fitted tank is also one size, um, which is very interesting. I do not think that this tank should be just a one size tank, to be honest with you. I mean, it's pretty, it's supposed to be fitted and I know it's going to fit people differently, but it's pretty fitted on me. Like, I think that uh, there should be other sizes because somebody else like bigger than me wanted to wear this. This is not going to fit. It's not like there is, I guess there's a little room in it. It's a little stretchy, but it's not, I mean, it's just barely fitting me and it's see-through. So that's something that I don't really like because I have like a baby blue bra on and you can tell, you can see everything. So this tank is probably a no, although it's comfortable. Um, the kimono, I think, it, uh, well, I know is a yes. Um, it's just, I would style it differently. And then the jeans shorts, I need jean shorts. So these are going to be a yes. They just, just fit so good. Um, okay. So you guys tell me what you think about this outfit. We'll get into the next one. Hold on. Okay. So I have on the Cody tunic striped tank, which is 
It is. So I think it's funny. Um, this outfit doesn't work. Um, I think it's an interesting outfit choice. It's the, the tunic is longer than the shorts. So unless I turn to the side where there's a slit, you can't even see like my shorts. Um, and the shorts are really, really cute. Um, they're just not cute with this top. The Wanderer shorts in Chile are, by Sanctuary are 55, 20. Now she went up a size in the shorts. Um, my cut from the cloth went down a size to an eight. I'm normally a 10. Um, they fit because cut runs big. And Sanctuary must run small because she up to a 31 and they fit beautifully. So let me show you. This is the tank, first of all. And I don't need this, but you can barely see the shorts. Look at that, it's so long. Um, I have a nice tank that I like better that's gray and white stripe that I got from them. So this is, while it fits nice and I would recommend it, it's soft if you like tunics, it's great. This is really, really comfortable. Um, this is a medium for reference. Um, it's really comfortable, guys. It's just, it's very long and it's just not something, there's the back. It's not something I need two of. So let me show you the shorts. All right, so look, this is so long. Not like it's scooped in the back, so it's not like you can really tie it. But these are like a beautiful coral. They've got a little button detail here. Um, they're cuffed one time. They um, they're pretty. They're loose. They have enough. They have enough. I can't see, but they have enough room here to be comfortable. They're just a good, perfect fit. Um, these are like 55 something too, so um, they have little pockets. That might aggravate me because sometimes pockets will like after you wash them flip up. But, um, but no, they're cute. There is some gapping right here. Um, oh, I don't think I did that in the frame. But there's some gapping right here, so um, that part I don't love. Like, <clears throat> the cut from the cloth, it didn't gap. It, like, hugged really good there. Um, but this does have some gapping in. It's a color that I don't have a lot to go with other than solid colored tops. Um, but I do like them. So I don't know, guys, on these, truly. They're nice. See, this pocket's already starting to flip up. They're nice. Um, they fit. They're... I don't know, I just saw like something wasn't looking so good right there. Alright, so like them, but um and I, I like the top. There's this top is really, really comfortable. It'd be great with um a pair of leggings, or if you were taller than me and you did have Bermuda shorts, it might be cute with something like that too. Um, so let's try on the last outfit is a jacket and then two dresses. One of the dresses, I hope it fits. It's very pretty. So we'll see. Um, but yeah, let me know what you think about, about this one. So this dress is really cute. It's just got this, um, crisscross in the front. It's not a tag there, but I'm going to tuck that in. Um, very comfortable. So, and I don't, I don't have any shape wear on or nothing, um, but it's an easy wear dress. And it's not hugging me anywhere inappropriately. Um, but at the same time, I don't know that it does much for my figure. It's just sort of like boxing. It comes in a little bit like here, but not much. Let's add the jacket that they recommended. I got a white jacket though, just like this from, um, and this is cut from the cloth. This is 78, um, but I got one just like this from Old Navy that I like just as well. Yeah, I like the jacket. Jacket's nice. Um, I guess they have it so you can roll it up. And jacket, the jacket's here for us in um, Virginia. It really is more of a, just a springtime or fall time piece that you can wear. You can't really wear a jacket here in uh, in the summer. It's just too hot. So there it is rolled to give you reference and then down. The jacket makes this dress cuter because it gives it some structure and shape, I think. 
All right, so I'm gonna back actually back up so you guys can see. So, and I didn't see this before, the jacket has a raw, can you guys see this? It's got like a raw hem all the way, it goes all the way around. It hits me at a nice spot, I think, like right above my, my backside. It just comes in and cuts really nicely. So this is a nice jacket. Let me just double check the price on the jacket. I love it actually. Um, so it's the Kara denim jacket by cut from the cloth and it would be 7120 because I get an extra 20% off it probably was 78 I'm guessing originally but boy is it a nice jacket hard to say no to but I just I don't have the funds right now to um to have two white jackets and do that I have to be careful with my money right now so this is one of those times it's not the best and actually, we've got some trips going coming up and uh, braces for my daughter, which were late, really late to the game. She actually needed those braces when I was going through a divorce when she was about 12. And at that time, we couldn't afford it. So, um, okay. So, this is a beautiful outfit. It just isn't, I don't think I need it. So, let's try the other, the other dress on with this too. So, am I recording? Yeah. Okay, so the, this is the Carolina cross front dress in medium. It is by Alice and Joy and it's on sale with my discount for $35.99. So the one I was really hoping would look good on me. Um, it's constructed well. It is actually tacked here. And, but I don't, I think I have a problem, but underneath there's like on the bottom half of this, there is a, um, like a slip that's built in. The slip is made of a different material and it's not stretchy. It's pretty tight. So I don't think it looks bad necessarily, but um, there it is. It's uncomfortable, the skirt, the, the piece underneath it. And it also looks like it's inside out, which is, it is inside out. So how am I wearing this? I'll have to look at that. It looks like maybe the slip was actually built in and somebody sewed it in inside out. That's really, really weird. Oh, falling. Oh, well, maybe that helps. I'm going to step on that and let you guys see. Obviously, I put a pair of heels on. So, it's cute and I like the color. Maybe I have the whole dress on inside out. No? Okay, well, I don't know. I'll have to see what's going on with that slip under there because this slip's definitely inside out. Okay. I like the color. It's a nice, bright, fun color, but I do think that overall um, it's very uncomfortable with the slip, but something's going on with the slip, so I gotta look at that. It's a good price, too, so this is what I was hoping would fit. And then she also recommended the same jacket. There we go. It's cute with the jacket too. And I do like this jacket. This jacket is like stretchy and just cuts nice. It cuts in real nice. It's not, I mean, it's, I forgot what size it is. Um, I'll tell you guys both. The dress is a medium. The jacket's a large, which is good. I, anything smaller, I would have. I have some medium jackets, but this one I think would have been too small on a medium. So it feels better this way and looks better. There's definitely, you know, it's, it's not tight. It's plenty of room. Even if, even if I wanted to button it, I could. So but I usually... I don't know about you guys, do you ever button your jackets up, your jean jackets? I never ever do, ever. Just too many buttons, but I actually like the look of it open, so. Okay, so that's it. So I'll be right back with final thoughts. Guys, so this was a good box overall. I really liked everything. Um, I can't afford to keep everything. I was really excited about the red Alice and Joy dress, which is only $35.99, and I was thinking, oh, if that fits, I'm gonna get it. 
I did check this. They did, somebody did sew in the skirt inside out. Um, so for that reason, it's poorly constructed on the inside of it. I'm going to pass. Um, I'm not, I just, I don't know why they would have done that. Ooh, I'll show you guys actually as I drop everything. So... So here's the skirt and the seam is on the, like this, not, not that anybody would see it. It should be on this side where it's clean. Um, I don't know why they did that to it, laziness. Somebody who was making this wasn't doing, paying attention. Or, I know they actually have machines now that, that make clothes too, um, automated machines that, that make clothes. Um, it just but usually there's something on those machines that catches that so that it doesn't, it doesn't happen. So, um, yeah. So anyway, that's going to be a no because of that, um, that reason. And while it was cute, I'm not sure it was super figure flattering. All right. So let me have my price sheet. I am going to get these jean shorts, um, for 55, 20. I really like them. They fit, they look really nice. Um, I am getting this kimono, Kimmy tie-dye kimono. This is only $19.99, so I'm getting that. I need to wash it. Um, the denim jacket is $71.20. I am so on the fence about this jacket because I really, really liked how it fit. It was super comfortable and I think super flattering. It is a little pricey. This is a maybe. I don't need two jackets though. Um, I'm gonna put my other one on and see if it's stretchy too and if I like it just as much, I'll send that one back. Um, this one, I'll send this one back. If I don't like it as much, I might keep this. I'm considering putting, like, I don't know how to do it, but maybe doing a posh thing and trying to sell some of the clothes. I actually have a couple things that I'm, I don't wear that have tags on them and um, they would be great to put up there too. Um, so, if anybody knows how to use Posh or uses Posh, let me know. Um, so this one is a maybe. Um, this little tunic, I really liked with the together. And it, this is only $23.99. This is also a maybe. Um, but I did like it a lot with the jacket. So, um, and for $23.99, it was so comfortable for summer. Like, I could wear this today. And, you know, I could put a little, a little cardigan on if I wanted or I could put a little jacket on if I'm chilly in somewhere and then when I'm out, take it um, take it off. I think it did look better with a jacket than alone, but for 23 bucks, it was so comfortable. I mean, it's so soft and comfy, so that's a maybe. Um, all right, so these shorts, um, the Wanderer short and chilly uh, by Sanctuary are 55.20. They are already pretty wrinkled just from trying them on. I'll show you guys. Just from trying them on, look how wrinkled they got. I don't know what these the material is on these guys. And um, they have the pockets in the back, which I think are gonna flip up in time. Here we go, and drive me crazy. Oh, there's an extra button in here, look at that. There's a little extra button in case your button falls off. They sewed it in, that's a neat, neat thing. Um, so you have to turn this garment inside out, wash separately, wash in cold water, lay flat to dry, keep away from sun, iron low if necessary. Yeah, um, I don't, also don't think, these are cute and they fit. I just don't think that I'm going to be happy overall with them because they're, they're beautiful color, but I just don't have a lot to wear with these. And um, the only colors I could really think to wear with these is like a white, a black, you know, like solids. Um, she put gray with it and I didn't like that. Um, so, or a floral top that was, that had this color in it would be cute too. Um, but I don't think I have that. So these are going to be a no. And then there is this little tunic. Great tunic. Um, very soft, very comfortable. Um, very lightweight. It would be fantastic for the summer for somebody. Um, but again, it's very long tunic style and I'm not going to wear a legging in the summer. So unless you're somebody that like, if you love Bermuda shorts, and I would recommend this. I think it would look cute with Bermudas, but that's a no for me. Um, and that was... How much was it? Um, 
well, $35.20, and it was very see-through. Oh, uh, that wasn't see-through. I'm sorry, this is $35.20. I can't find that on there. Oh, there it is. No. Uh, $23.99 for the little gray and white one, which is great, but I have a gray and white tank that's, like, not tunic from them that I really like. So this is the Michael Stars one. Very, very see-through. Um, fitted tank, one size, 35 it, It's not a bad piece, but um, you would... Like, you can't wear this tank, this fitted tank. It's, I think it's meant to wear under something. So you're not going to wear another cami under here because it's so fitted. So I think you would wear this and then put a t-shirt on that was sheer or something like that over it. That would be how you use it. That being said, I don't need this. And so that's going back. Um, so I do need some help because I kind of have some split decisions. I'm definitely keeping the kimono and the jean shorts, but then I have um, the jacket, and this and this isn't expensive. I might just keep this because I just it was so comfortable. I just feel like on the weekends this would be fantastic just to run errands or whatever in, and obviously can be dressed up with the jackets, and I could put a little pair of strappy heels on with it, and like a long necklace that would be pretty. Oh no, maybe I wouldn't wear a long necklace. This had the cross front, so big earrings. So that's a maybe. So anyway, let me know what your thoughts are on this box and um, what you think I should keep, what you think I shouldn't. Especially my help with my maybes. I'm definitely not getting, um, definitely not getting this pile here. So these four items are going back for sure. Um, but the jacket and the little that little dress I need some help with. So I'll see you guys all soon, real soon. Actually, hopefully, I'm trying to get a couple of these videos done, even though I have no makeup on. I look like crap this morning because I just woke up. Um, I've got an overflow of boxes right now, and I just got in my FabFitFun style box, so I'm excited to get into that too. Um, so I'll see you guys soon. Oh, and hit the subscribe button if you're not subscribed. It's all clothing unboxings here. Um, I do have another, um, I other do some other stuff. I do some crystal unboxings and some fun other little boxes that we get beauty boxes and things. So my boxy charm came in. I have a very small, um, I have a blessed box. I have a very small. Grove Collaborative that came in, um, which is good timing because cleaning day. Um, I have a, I didn't open my Pop Sugar yet in front of you guys, and I have that. I opened it and looked at it, but you guys haven't seen it, so I want to show you that. Um, what else came in? I got an extra, Stitch Fix is coming in next week, Trunks Junk Club sometime maybe next week or the week after. Um, the FabFitFun Style Box is clothing. Uh, my jewel scent order came in is also with my monthly my monthly subscription from them, and I haven't really done a jewel scent video other than like once. Um, I am a distributor for for jewel scent, so I want to show you that because um, those are really the best candles. Some I know some of you have, uh, several of you actually had purchased some of the candles, and I think that you are enjoying them. They have rings, necklaces, earrings inside, and you can win up to like a ten thousand um, dollar piece of jewelry as well. So um, I will see you all again soon. There's a lot of fun stuff coming up, so I hope you'll stick around. I've enjoyed uh, so much doing, doing YouTube and making some new friends. So I'll see you all soon. Bye.